Can you ever stare at your ceiling and wonder, what am I even doing here? Yeah, most people probably do. In this massive universe where planets hurl around the stars and these stars exist amongst millions and billions of others in these massive galaxies within a universe of countless galaxies, how can we ever amount to anything? What's the point of me even doing this? Why am I here? Okay. Our Earth has a diameter of 12,742 kilometers. And the Milky Way galaxy has one of around 106,000 light years. And one light year alone is 9.5 trillion kilometers. This galaxy is filled with over 100 billion stars, many of them larger than our sun. Our sun alone can fit 1.3 million Earths inside of it. And this very sun makes up 99.86% of our solar system's total mass. From what we know, there is an estimated 100 billion galaxies in the universe. But who knows? As technology improves and we're able to learn more, this could increase to 200 billion galaxies. In the broad scheme of the universe, we're nothing. Not even a visible speck. So here we are, just a small, insignificant human on a small, insignificant planet, populated by over 7 billion other humans. Most people's lives go completely unnoticed by the majority of the global population. A human life passes in the blink of an eye in comparison to all of Earth's history. Even if you become a massive success during your lifetime, it's highly unlikely that you'll still be remembered in a hundred or so years. Let's say your name's Bob. You're just one of possibly millions of Roberts in the world. Even if you become rich and famous, there have already been so many Bobs before you. On Google, there's an entire list of famous Bobs, including Robert Beltran, Bob Bergen, Bob Kane, Robbie Coltrane, Robert Downey Jr., Bob G. Miller, Bob J. Miller, Bob L. Miller, Robert Shaw, Robert Frost, Bob Ross, Bob the Builder, Bob Hawk, Bobby Fisher, the list goes on. How could you ever make your mark in the world when so many have already come before you? I don't even know some of these Bobs and I chose the list to have familiar sounding ones. The different Bob something Millers with baseballers, I only listen to them it sounded funny. Anyway! Even if you're just another human, just another number, just another Bob, you are the only you there will ever be in this entire universe. And you have your own individual purpose in life. You'll talk to those particular people you do, you'll meet those particular people you do. Perhaps you will be one of those significant people entering another person's life. You'll use your abilities to uplift people or pull them down. You'll encourage or discourage both others and yourself. Every choice you make is, well, yours to make. And these choices will shape your future, as well as the futures of those around you. You have so much more of an impact than you think. With this knowledge, you can use your power in whatever way you like, be it wise or foolish. The influence you have in your small part of the world, in our tiny corner of the universe, is enough. It doesn't matter who you are now. What really matters is who you choose to become. You matter and you are capable of so much more than you believe. If it lasts, great. If not, at least you did your part for humanity.